So boom guys, as you can see, we have the Evolving Skies ETB. So today we're going to be opening up both of these. As you can see, we've got two different artworks. And in the UK, these released uh, late distributors and retailers didn't get them until this week, I believe. So that's why you'll start seeing these in stores eventually. But in the UK, these didn't release initially on the same release day. Hence why we couldn't get them early and do a video when these released all before. So yeah, I literally just got my hands on them now. Shout out to Eclipse Cards for the hookup. And in my Discord, a few people managed to find these in their uh, local card stores and they managed to get some cool pulls. Here's some of the pull rates they have pulled from their one. So I'm hoping we get the same pull rates because there's so many secret rares and full arts I still need from this collection or this set. So hopefully we can pull them today. As you can see, we've got the two ETBs. First ETB, you got Sylveon, Espeon, Glaceon and Vaporeon. And then the second ETB, you got Leafeon, Umbreon, Flareon and Jolteon. So you got all eight evolutions and there you go. Uh, the only differences are the dividers and sleeves as well as the color dices. So the dices are different colors apart from that and the box you get eight packs which is pretty standard in main set ETBs. Uh, so yeah let's get into this, let's get into the opening. Um, so yeah let's go. Uh, let me find my scissors and yeah we'll do one ETB at a time see the pull rates per ETB can we get as good pull rates as the other members have been um, I've seen some Americans commented in my videos saying they bought the ETBs and the pull rates were pretty bad for them but obviously I want to stress this point it's always random you can have a good ETB you could have a bad ETB it's always random that's how it is with Pokemon cards same with blisters you can get a good blister or you can get a bad blister with bad pull rates so yeah Eight booster packs since we was showing you uh, everything that comes in here. We've got eight booster packs here. Wait, hold on. As I expected, it was stuck in here. Always keep an eye out for that. That happens with like promo cards and stuff. They get stuck in those uh, inserts. So yeah, a lot of promo cards go missing that way. Uh, but acrylic um, damage markers. Here you got the dices. So blue and pink and the set logo is, there we go, set logo there so yeah, blue and pink for this one so here you got the dividers should be a little bit different on the back yep same as the box design here you get your pack of energies code card to grab the sleeves etc on the online game here you got a pack of sleeves pretty nice sleeves looks more matte finish again i love the glossy sleeve so again we're getting matte sleeves as well as you get the rule book so let me just put everything away back in the box i thought we lost the pack there but luckily we found it stuck in the insert but what we're gonna do is hopefully we get some good pull rates today like i said so many cards that i need from this set still i've went out and bought loads of booster packs loose packs uh blisters from local stores uh, and still so just because it's a huge set there's so many cool cards so many great characters in this set most sets have like maybe two three characters I like but here we've got all the evolutions you got the Rayquazas uh, uh, Gyarados etc but first pack nothing and then what what's the other one Suicune that's it I almost forgot Suicune but yeah so many great cards so hopefully we can pull them but yeah eight packs here we'll see how what we're getting out of each ETB but like I always say pull rates are always random um, but it's always good to see what can we get and obviously we showed you some of our members pools in our discord If you want to get involved and join the discord sign up to YouTube membership And then you connect it with discord to get access to our private discord We post release links deals restocks etc in there So if you want to join join but oh elder Goss hollow rare so first hit there we go All right, come on. Let's see what we can do. Oh, oh, that was a white code though Hold on. Let's see if the first so they're all white codes because the first pack had uh, zero hits as well. So same thing happened with the blisters. We had some blisters which would come with all white codes as well. So that's something to look out for as well. Um, but yeah, let's see what we can get here. Pumpkaboo, Begone, love this. C dot, Shell gone, and Smeagol. So you saw there's a white code but zero hits there. Let's put this in the back like that. Come on, I'm hoping for a secret rare. So you saw some members getting double secrets per ETB. We're hoping for the same sort of luck, guys, because obviously, like I said, so many cards I need from this set. It's going to be so expensive to hunt them all down. I could buy the singles, but where's the fun in that? My fun when it comes to Pokemon is opening packs, chasing the cards I like. Uh, we do buy uh, singles eventually, but still, since it's still a new set, 
we still got lots of opportunity to buy the packs and pull them because we're still going to be opening loads of this set so there's no rush to get the singles just yet plus a lot of them are very expensive especially the old arts and stuff yeah but yeah let me know how's your hunting going have you been able to pull the chase cards you've wanted or you're still hunting has your luck been good has your luck been bad let me know what's your best card you pulled so far i think ours would be i think the old art glaceon v max but yeah stoutland and melodic come on what we've done five packs and we only got a hollow rare so hopefully the goods are about to come um but yeah let's go copycat zinnia's resolve uh hop hip swablu zora aura zora sorry uh bit lil lava log and oh aroma lady rainbow secret let's go we'll take that however as you can see the centering is terrible as you can see there left to right on the back left to right a little bit as well but the front you can really see it so yeah centering has been an issue since i think chilling rain battle styles wasn't much of a problem right chilling rain is a very noticeable problem then but yeah rainbow secret has been pulled not something i would add to my collection however pulling a rainbow secret is always great regardless of what it is or secret in general like even if you get full i'd be pretty happy from etb so let's see at least we pulled something nice and but so far only two hits out of eight we still got this pack and the other one um keep pulling two at a time sorry guys but ooh, go guys and last pack for this one let's switch it to the back because they're all white codes anyway so all right guys best of luck here hopefully we get some good pulls oh my god i keep pulling that was like three cards there i don't know why my pulling is not that good today but let's go pump kaboo rough let oh two cards again low tide wishy wa wishy cat wash and then drampa so as you saw there you only got two hits however one being a secret rare is pretty good so not too bad and now we're going to get into the second etb so let's get into that i always cut a line there or a little rip at least and you can rip that easily and then boom players guide so yeah, I haven't even shown you the player's guide. They'll be the same thing in both, but then you've got the set list there. It shows you what playable cards and stuff in the beginning. And then in here, you've got the player's guide, but I always go to the back page because that's where you get all the secret res. Uh, so yeah, all the gold ones here. Uh, from this lot, I only want the Inteleon. And then here, oh my god, let's go through what we want. We want the Rayquaza alt, we want the Rayquaza rainbow, Umbreon alt, Umbreon rainbow. We want all the evolutions in rainbow form. We want Sylveon VMAX, Glaceon, Leafeon. Uh, and full art trainers, not really any I need. And then we come over here. Noiva and Batman. I love Batman. I have a lot of Batman collectibles. I collect a lot of Batman merchandise. However, I'm not sure. I'm not a fan of Noiva, but the artwork is pretty cool uh, with the Batman vibes. But yeah, Rayquaza, full arts. I need both of them. Dragonite, full arts. I need both of them. Umbreon, full art. Alt, I want. And Jolteon V, full art. Regular. I do love that one. Sylveon, Alt, I want. And what else is there? So many full arts. Look at that. Three pages of full arts. Um, and then Glaceon Alt, Gyarados Full Art, Leafeon Alt. I wouldn't mind the Flareon Alt if I get a good centered one, I reckon, because there is no. Uh, I reckon I, I, I wouldn't mind the Flareon Full Art as well. They don't have the old art, unfortunately, but we do have that one in Japanese. We managed to pull it and add it to the collection. Might grade that one with Ace, you know, because I'm not really fussed to have that by PSA. But. Let's go. Yes, eight packs here. So eight booster packs. Player's guide. Here. Uh, energies. Here's the sleeves to match the, the lid, of course, and the box design. We've got the dividers here and the backside. Just a little bit different artwork. And then there's the code card for that. I might give the code cards to my Discord uh, just because it's just a special product. Uh, but there we go. Damage dices. And then here. Um, the dice is here so you've got clear with green and then orange so it just matches the theme of the box colorway uh, but yeah that's all the extras plus the eight packs let's go so let me know how yours pull rates have been going with your etbs and also let me know if you managed to cop the etbs they see oh i see something here uh they seem to be selling out everywhere like i posted a game restock game restock today and i posted did i do four from the back i think so uh, free from the back actually, but yeah, for now. Um, I did a game restock today. Game restocked it today. I posted it and I sold out pretty fast. There wasn't many, I don't think. Uh, so yeah, let me know if you managed to cop a lot of local card stores are selling out. I think because booster boxes are selling out, blisters are selling out. 
but there will be waves of this product coming so don't pay resale for this product do not pay over retail for Volvox guys but Sylveon VMAX again the centering is not so good um, but there we go Sylveon VMAX so one hit so far here and yeah we only got the rainbow rare there apart from the hollow rare only a rainbow rare on the, set of the first box oh this code cards are all normal so previous box we didn't get any green codes so yeah this box is back to normal so four from the back we'll just run for it normally um, but yeah let me know if you managed to find this product to cop this product it's pretty easy to cop you should be able to find stores um, easily with this especially when it comes obviously it's coming in waves at the moment because obviously we had a late delivery in the UK but nothing here um, but yeah it shouldn't be too hard if you try and cop if you're waiting then I wouldn't suggest waiting to cop I suggest trying to cop ASAP because they seem to be selling out um, so yeah keep an eye out at your local game uh, game the video game retailer not like a card store because uh, they should be getting them as well Smith should have them but you can check online for click and collect and in-store availability so that's a good thing about Smith's you can check there but just a swift tree here but yeah hopefully you guys managed to cop this if you're looking for this product uh, but hope oh oh what is that I see something there I'm trying to guess what it is but I don't want to spoil it for myself knowing me I'll think it's like something crazy and end up being just a regular V but I don't know what's going on today I'm picking out two cards at a time so yeah Zora tentacle hop it swell blue and a Jolteon V Max so two V Maxes in this which is pretty decent to be honest but there isn't really any V Maxes we're after we've got them all now the Gyarados and Rayquaza are the only two I really wanted so we've got them all already but wouldn't mind more Rayquazas we're doubling and tripling up on the Rayquazas for my, for my collection uh, the evolutions I think I'll go for them actually but the centering has to be perfect because we get a lot of them but yeah reverse Eevee's not bad and just a Stoutland there come on hoping for another secret if not a full art if we see a full art today that'd be nice but yeah, it's kind of a decent video. Just show you what, what's inside these boxes, uh, what the pull rates in our boxes. I've showed you the pull rates from other members' boxes. So you can kind of see an average pull rate there, but obviously we'll open more in the future. Hopefully I can do it. maybe a 10 ETB opening in the future. I do have a case maybe coming, but ooh, slacking hollow. So this box does have more hits. Hopefully we get that 50% ratio. That's always a nice. If you get at least four hits in your ETB, you're doing pretty well. Uh, so yeah, let's go code card come on can we get a full art sometimes I'm excited for the full arts rather than secrets at the moment because there's so many full arts so many great full arts especially the Rayquaza full art alternative art even the regular full art is pretty nice so yeah elemental badge and oh my god the rainbow res after rainbow res with these ETBs centering's a lot better on this one we got Raihan however I think we pulled two of these from the triple blisters okay centering on the back is not great left to right a bit but yeah left to right a bit on the front but not as bad as the aroma lady we had earlier so decent decent pull another rainbow red bro these are sick literally a rainbow red every etb i've seen so far obviously this might not be the case with you it's always random i just want to stress that point because obviously i'm not trying to say if you buy an etb you're going to get the same pull rates you're going to get the same luck it happens with the triple blisters i'll open triple blisters i'll get zero hits but then there'll be a lot of good hits out of some of them and then some will have zero or one hit so it's always random uh it's always the luck of the draw but the last pack last hit is an appleton but i'm pretty happy with the pull rates we got we got a secret in each single one obviously nothing we can tick off my list of stuff i want as i showed you earlier but not too bad first etb shows you two hits sometimes you can be left with two hits but the second etb we had four hits with double v maxes a secret rare and a hollow rare so four hits is kind of a nice pull rate if you do get four you're pretty much winning in an etb that's like 50 percent pull rate so it's nice to get that but not bad at all two secret rares two etbs pretty decent let me know your pull rates let us know in the comments because then people can scroll through the comments see what everyone's getting see if this product is worth getting if everyone's getting good pulls from it because from what i've seen everyone's getting good pulls maybe the uk batch is a good one who knows but guys like subscribe and yeah we'll have more evolving skies etbs for sure open on this channel um so yeah stay tuned we'll do some bigger openings maybe a 4 etb a 5 etb opening a 10 etb opening if we can but yeah like and subscribe we have hundreds and hundreds of packs of evolving sky still to upload because we've opened plenty of booster boxes of this set so don't miss out stay tuned here and help us get to 10k we're almost there so yeah like subscribe and i'll see you next time peace